Welcome back to a brand new video, TDF Gaming, jumping back into 7 Days to Die, but this time we're going into the Wild West mod. Let's not waste too much time, we're going to jump straight into it, we'll talk about it as we're going. Let's go new game, 7 Days Wild Wild West. We're going to change to Warrior, we'll go Warrior difficulty, we're going to go 150% XP so we get into it a little bit. Uh, we'll go with just standard settings across the board, I'll up those later if we need to. Just kind of get a feel for it. We'll wait. Player block damage 200%. Loot abundance 150. Loot respawn 10. Blood moon count 64. Mark airdrops on. And then I think that's really it. Claim size 71. Everything else is pretty standard. I'm excited to try this one out though. After that Ravenhurst playthrough where everything was so super slow, this one should be quite a bit faster. We are. It does have a very specific special map that's built for this mod specifically. It's got its own map and its own POIs. And obviously it's a bunch of the POIs that you normally see in game. I know that a lot of people worked on this mod. I believe Am Amaris? Um, Amaris is the one that worked on the mod mainly, and it's got some other modlets and stuff from a, some other very talented 7 Days to Die modders, but this is actually one of the quickest load times of any map I've played, probably because of the smaller map and the, the, you know, probably a few less resources than usual. Here we go. If you guys want to read the starting stuff, you guys can do that. You guys can pause right there and read the little messages we get. I'm not going to put you guys through me trying to read these things. Here we go. And... There you go. All right, so we got to finish our first quest and get to the first trader. We are on the boat here. I don't know if we... Do we want to go inside here? I don't know if it's worth it or not. Let's just search really quickly here in the outskirts. Put these shoes on. No, no, no. Put those on. There you go. All right, let's just carefully search these first few things here. Without any tools or anything. We do have a lot of things on our hotbar. I guess we should check out what those are. There you go. We're going to jump back out here. Let's go ahead. Should we just go ahead and go to shore? Or should we fight this guy real quick? Oh, man. We're going to have to fight Fisticuff style. Let's go ahead and put the bandage over here. There's a couple challenges. We'll just put those up in our inventory real quick. A homestead challenge. Hunter achievement quest. Put that there. That there. There you go. We'll get ourselves some weapons and stuff made in just a second. You guys not coming this way? What's up? Oh, okay. Oh, I guess we're going across. <laughs> not the way we planned it. Let's go jump across. We can come back here, I guess, later and look around. I don't know if it's worth searching or not. Very cool, though. That's the boat that we came in on. And I guess we'll go this way. Get up here to the ground. Are they chasing the cross? No, they got lost. All right, let's go ahead and get started with our typical seven days to die starter stuff. We need a little bit of fiber. Let's get that. Let's get all the way up here. So there is zombies in the first little bit when you first spawn in. Okay. It's important to know. We'll grab a few supplies up here. Get a lay out of the land. There is a special map, like you said, with this one. Uh, let me see. That's not it. I thought it was... Hmm. I thought there was a speci specific map that loaded up. All right, craft bedroll. All right, let's go bedroll. Craft. There you go. Place the bedroll. Boom. All right, next we need to go ahead and get ourselves some wood. Let's do that. Get a stone. Oh, man, I'm so glad we're back to regular seven days a night crafting. Stone axe. There we go. Gather a little bit more while we're cruising this way. Now, there's not going to be any highways in this mod. From what we read, it's all dirt roads instead of the typical highways. There's not going to be any big cities. It's going to be all the Wild West POIs. Put that right there. Get a little bit more wood. There we go. XP should come in pretty quickly. We'll get a couple levels pretty fast. Get a little more fiber. All right, we need to do a hat. Got to have the hat. The pants. And the shirt. Got it. There you go. And there you go. Boom. All right, all dressed up. Let's see where we're going now. Now we need a hunting club. Got it. We'll put that down on our two or three slot there. Gather plant fibers again. Hey, we'll stay in this little area here. I like it here. There we go. Need a few feathers. There we go. Finally got the feathers. Let's go ahead and craft a hunting bow. 
we go. Bow coming up. And we need at least five arrows. Boom. We'll make five more if we can. All right. We'll get some arrows made up. And then we should get the trader one now. There you go. Trader one is right over here. Right next to us. Oh, that's a very different looking trader. Okay. Is it underground? Or is it just what the trader looks like? Oh, okay. There we go. We got somebody right there. We got good old Trader Hugh. Oh, What's I'll up, man? Business with you. Long we'll talk to you. Here. Check out your inventory. What you got for us? Anything crazy? Oh, I love it. There's revolvers. Ten thousand dollars though. A little expensive. Revolver Raven. Oh, very cool. Tree resin. Warrior bow. Obviously, I can't get any of these right now. I'm just kind of looking through. Advanced bellows. Oh, Very cool. was there something else? All right, uh, next one is 25 infected settlers. So we need to get rid of 25 infected settlers. All right, do a little bit of searching while we're waiting. And let's check out this little spot here. Yeah, we'll do this, and then we'll check out the other missions that are on our hot bar. Here we go. Anybody in here? Come on, guys. All right, let's bring them on out. There we go. Ah, they all got hats on. I love it. Oh, and I can't hit anything. Oh, nope. There we go. All right, let's try this again. Oh, come on. Solid shot, dude. There you go. Shoot you in the right there. <laughs> uh, early game archery. We're struggling. Here we go. All right, let's go ahead and kill this lady off. We gotta kill 25. I think you count as infected, right? Look at the hat on this guy. This is awesome. There we go. <laughs> oh man. I like the looks of these guys. Man. Taking a lot of hits to get these guys. Get up. Wow, so many hits. I haven't even killed one yet. Ooh. That was a beast. That took a long time to get that one. Let's hit you with a torch. There you go. Light you on fire. Let that drain out just a little. There we go. Two out of 25. Search that. After our last experience with Ravenhurst, this is still way, way better. There you go. Hit him right in the knee. Come on. There you go. Let's jump over and finish this guy off. Got it. All right. Let's do a little bit of searching. Campfire I can actually use. New journal activity map. Okay. We'll check that out in just a second. Let's check out our first little POI. There they go. A couple more friends up top. No, on the side. There you are. What's up? Come here, big guy. No. All right, let's jump over. <laughs> there you go. Let him do his thing. Got it. Oh, there's a crawler. All right, come on, man. All right, I'll shoot you a couple times. Oh, come on. Come on, I need you to die. There we go. There you go. All right, five out of 25. We're getting there. Let's go climb the ladder. Can I get up there? No. Search that. Oh, nice. An easy stone. Oh, good. Another crawler. Oh, there's a couple over there. Okay. 
quite a few things in this little tiny POI. Coming over this way, guys. Don't accidentally break that bag. Come on, stand up. What is she doing? Not real sure. Let's see if we, let's see if we can jump across. There you go. Gotcha. All right, back across. <laughs> I knew you guys were coming. Okay, let's let our stam regen, and then we'll jump over there. We got a couple things over here too. Search these while we're waiting. Got that. Oh, there we go. Got a couple things out of that. All right, let me see what we got. We got a new helmet. Perfect. We got some charred meat, ergonomic grip, short iron pipe. Very nice. All right, ready. <laughs> you guys need to come on out, man. You're over there just stuck. All right. Let's see if we can go like this. Search that. And go. Oh, man, we didn't make it. That's fine. There you go. Jump down, buddy. There you go. Let's go. All right, we'll get a few easy shots in on these guys. I see the XP bar down on the bottom right. Okay. Oh, my bad. My bad. All right, try again. There we go. Nine zombies already. This is a small POI for nine zombies. All right, let's go back up. We could definitely build like a first little starter hut here. Got that searched up. Get those. These are worth breaking down. Uh, not too bad. We don't really need need them though. That's not too bad. Right, we already got that. Oh, there we go. Ammo pile. Nice. A little bit of nine mil. Okay. There we go. Wild West cooler. A little bit of water. Awesome. Okay, anything else around here I need to search up? Oh, what's up, dude? Alright, I don't know how he didn't wake up. Oh, we actually got him. Oh, got a couple guys. There's a lot of zombies in one POI. Real quick. Got it. Let's search that. Let's go ahead and punch this dude in the head. Got it. We need to repair our club. Oh, I'm so glad we can repair it. Alright, this guy's been walking around in circles out here. Let's go check him out. More medical, perfect. Search these guys. Some kind of acid or something. Alright, let's go check this guy out. And then we'll check out these other challenges here in just a second. Let's go ahead and punch you in the head. There you go. We're about to hit level 2 in just a second. We're already up to about to be 13 kills. So already halfway to the first goal. There we go, 13. Let's go ahead and check out these other challenges. There's a couple of them. We've got the Chuck Wagon Dinner Bell Challenge. It's an optional quest. Receive one skill point for eliminating 250 Screamer Scouts. Wow. That is a lot. Hopefully they don't come in right now. <laughs> Alright, we got that. What's the other one? We've got Feral Gunslinger. Be warned, he is armed and dangerous. Prepare yourself properly for this bounty quest. Okay. He doesn't show up like right here, does he? I assume that it just means we're going to eventually see him out there. I'm not 100% sure. All right. Last one is the Homestead Challenge. Players to some of the Homestead features in the Wild West mod. All right. We'll do that. And last one is the Hunter Achievement Quest. Do that one right there. 
on a variety of animals through different stages of progression. Very cool. All right, I think that's all the stuff. Not too bad. All right, let's go hit up another POI and see if we can knock out this first mission. So that one was done. I like this, so very different feel. I can't wait to get the rifle or a pistol. That would help out a lot. There's a little city right there. And we got like an actual house over here. This might be this might be a good first stop. Yeah, I think we should do this. Let's go over here. Search all that. All right. Welcome to the ranch. Okay, this looks like your typical POI. We've been in this one before. I think this one we have to go in the barn and then jump across. All right. We got snakes in this one. All right, we're going to need more more stones. All right, do we have any... What is that? Just some stone in the background. Okay. We'll grab a little bit of that. All right. Make a few arrows. this place out nothing in there little silo oh there's a friend what's up man there you go 14 down there you go all right this guy takes forever let's go Level two. Right, wait for a second, and boom. Oh. oh, my bad. I got too close again. I gotta stop with that. There we go. All right, let's go sneak in here. Wake that guy up. Get a nice little sneak bonus. Come on, dude. Right here. Oh, he's got a he's got a bottle in his hand. Look at that. <laughs> Zombies drinking. There we go. He's done already. Okay. We're at 16 of 25. Really? Nothing else up here? Okay. It's not as bad as the first one. They must be in the actual house. We'll come back out for some of these supplies. Let's go ahead and break that. And let's go across. Oh, hold on. Got it. Does that count? I'm not sure. Get this guy for some free feathers. Nice. 20 feathers. Pick all that up. All right. Anything good in here? Got a gun safe. We're definitely not getting any there anytime soon. All right. Get a pile of books. All right. We got friends somewhere. I think it's right here. Actually, it sounds like they're already out to the door. Nope, that's just straight outside. Okay. Alright, ready? Oh god, we're out of out of nope. Nope. There you go. Oh, we didn't make that jump. <laughs> that was a miss. Not dead yet. Stay on him. 17. Ooh, stam. Stam issues. Got a friend over there. there go. 18 out of 25. Alright. Let's go back across again. What do we get for this? I think you can still wrench these down. Oh, we can search them too. Nice. I know that they said there's still some kind of wrenching according to their little guide. Here. 
Alright, let's go jumping across again. What's up, guys? Oh, come on. That was like right through her head. <laughs> there you go. Alright, we got four whole arrows left. Oh, come on. go. Finish her off. Oh, that should have hit. Another one down. Alright. Uh, I guess we can go down and get this guy. Don't break that because I need that to get across. Stop it. Oh, my bad. I didn't see him running. So I was looking over there at that guy. Twenty out of twenty-five already. We're gonna finish this mission in just a second. It's only fourteen hundred. We're doing great. I'm definitely excited to see some progression. There you go. Punch you in the head a few times. Boom! Nice. A little bit of wood. Very very cool. All right, let's head back up again. We'll go jump across one more time. Go ahead and finish this house out. I need to get a shovel so we can get some of that cement and stuff together. I don't I don't know if it's important in this mod. We'll have to see. Kind of feels good to be in a more basic version of seven days though. Alright, so it's that. Okay. No one else in here. Alright, let's definitely break these down. in here? No. Nope. Search to the toilet. Nope. Last room over here. All right, we gotta repair that. Search that. Tank top. Got it. Okay, we also need. Oh yeah, any more arrows we can make them. All right, we'll search this guy into the next room. Yeah, we'll probably... It's 1,500. We might take over either this or the barn next door. I don't know. We'll figure that out. Yeah, just keep an eye on that side. If it's just the one. We can do it. Come on. There we go. Wait for it. That guy's not waking up yet. This is perfect. Got him. All right, quick shot on this guy. Nice. Oh, he dropped a bag. We're at 24 out of 25. Okay, search for that. A couple good things out of it. All right, let's repair this, and then we're going to break down these as well. Make sure we're not missing any loot in this one. Oh, we can pick up chairs again. My bad. Awesome. That's awesome. We, then we can use those for easy scrap. Water cooler instead of a refrigerator. Got the oven. Oh, that's a working iron stove. Ooh. If I put my claim block in here, can I pick that up? So if we go like this, right? There you go. Can I steal that? Ah, oh, I can't. Okay. That's fine. Let's keep searching. We'll take over this house for the early going. All right, a couple of random bottles. Some coffee. There you go. I need one more kill. Going down. Yeah, I hear you guys. All right, there's our friend here. Oh, we got it. Wow. Okay. Next one is kill 50. So that gave us a nice little XP boost. The other quest that we have, we've got the chuck wagon dinner bell. We have to place the chuck wagon dinner bell. And that'll stop the screamers from appearing. Okay. 
The other one is the Feral White Gunslinger Bounty. That one we gotta have three. We gotta be way more ready for that. Be warned, he is armed and dangerous. Okay. Home is where the hearth is. Gather 1,500 wood. And then the last one is Taste for Blood. Kill a rabbit, coyote, feral chicken, and a boar. Okay. All right. I want to knock out this room here. Make sure there's no one under here. All right. Let's see if we can get a pop shot on this guy. I see at least two or three in there. There you go. Oh, come on. Trying to aim just a little high. Really? There we go. Alright, let's do it. Alright, I know we're waking more people up. If we can kill this guy off first, we'll be alright. There you go. There's one. There you go. Oh, you guys are banging through right there. Perfect. Bring him up here. I just don't want to be cornered down here. It's a little dark. Oh, my bad. Dude, I'm having trouble pulling the boat. Come on. All right. Let's go like that. <laughs> there you go. Close him in. Repair this guy. And ready. Oh, I thought we let him through. There you go. Oh, came through quick. Come down, man. There we go. All right. Let the door keep us safe. Stand up a little bit. Oh, this inventory. There you go. Oh, come on. There you go. Come on, get up, get up. Get up. There we go. Next one. Got it. All right, let's check out this final loot room. And then we'll go up top and we'll live upstairs. I'll knock down the stairs so we can hide out up there. Leather case. Nice. Art of mining. Some more rounds. So we've got rounds already. I don't have a pistol yet, but let me see if I can make one. Let's worry about getting upstairs first. Search that guy. Oh, we got a shovel, I think. We're going to need lots more wood. Anything else out here crazy? Get that one. Got a workbench. There's a popping pills. All right. Got some look like steroids, I think. A little bit of iron. Another bandage. Awesome. Give me the arrow back. All right, cool. That one's done. Let's go up top and... Are you going to come banging on the door? You are. Dang it. All right. There we go. Oh, that opened the other side. Okay, let's go around and clear these guys out, and then we will make this place our home for the night. Very cool, very cool. This is kind of a huge breath of fresh air getting into a different mod. Take that. All right, get up. Get up. There we go. All right. Our friend there got knocked out. All right. Let's make it our home sweet home. Oh, I need to kill that chicken over there. Nope. Focus. Let's get some storage going. Let's go upstairs, see if I can knock out this fence. Oh, that's right. We can't close that. Hmm. Maybe we shouldn't do this. Can I pick this up? Oh, that didn't. <laughs> that actually didn't help. All right. Let's go land claim block. All right. I guess let's move towards the town. I see the chicken over there, and then I think I saw a bunny. All right. If that bunny stops, we'll, we'll get a hold of that bunny. Yep. I see a little western friend over there. Yeah, no. Bunny took off. We got no chance there. There is a nice little town right over here. Yeah, I don't know where that guy went. All right, let's go ahead and take this guy. All right, kind of 
wait a second. And there we go. All right, we got a couple books that we can read out of this. Let's go read those. We've got Needle and Thread Volume 1, Art of Mining Volume 7. Learn how to craft lanterns, mining hats, and helmet light bulbs. Nice. Kind of huge. Got some boots. A Liberty coin. Oh, cool. Coins are accepted currency used in the Wild West. Can be smelted in a forge. Nice. We got a little bit of food, a little bit of other stuff there. All right, so the question is, do we take over, do we move into town? Or do we go back towards the trader? Man, I don't know. Maybe we should stay near the trader just for the first few days. Let's do that. We'll, we'll move back towards the trader for now. And then we can make our way to town in the morning. Okay, we kind of thought about it for a second. We're going to go ahead and head into this house here. We're going to go ahead and go up top. I'll see if we can get rid of the staircase. And then we'll go up top and live in here. It won't take too long to bust out the staircase, and then we'll put in, we'll put in a ladder. All right, as long as they go to the back, they'll be banging around. Why do you have a construction hat in the old west? What are you doing? All right, another one done. We also hit level three. Awesome. We'll take a look at skill points either first thing tonight or tomorrow. All right, let's see if we can finish breaking this out. Yeah, we got rid of the stairs, and we threw a ladder in to get up the stairs, but we're going to try to just kind of take over a couple of these little rooms. Let's take over whichever one is the largest one. Uh, none of them, so honestly, we'll just probably knock out all the walls. So we'll go ahead and start here. Let's go ahead and get a little bit of storage made up. Can we make storage in this mod? Storage. Secure storage chest. Nice. Do a couple of those. Get everything out of the way. couple frames. Let's go with some frame shapes. Put those there. Alright, prepare that real quick. And let's throw down a few of the storages. There you go. Got a couple storages. We did get a couple things on our inventory that I didn't take a look at. Tree resin. Okay. An organic plant resin used in vicious or solid form. It's made, it's used for a lot of things. Okay. And then, got a little bit of food. Got a little bit more armor. Let's put the armor on. And then we'll have to take a look at through some of this stuff. We did get an iron fire axe. We'll put that here. There you go. That should help out a little bit for breaking through things, right? Oh yeah, it makes a big difference. Nice. Very cool, man. That'll definitely help out a lot. Clear out all this and make this a little bit bigger in here. And I think the storage is ready to go. So that's pretty good, man. For today one, day one is definitely going to be a little bit shorter video. We'll kind of get our lay of the land a little bit the next day or so. It looks like there is a town right over there. We started down here. Our bed's there. We need to put another bed roll down. Traveled up this way. Looks like there's something over here. And there was something right here we didn't see. Okay. I saw the trader, but I didn't see what was behind him. But alright guys, I'm going to end it there. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Like, comment, subscribe. The Wild West mod. Let me know if you guys want to see some more of this. I'm definitely excited to check it out. And hopefully we can get a little bit further into this mod. Seven days at least will be the, the, the main goal is to get through the first seven days. Then we'll kind of decide from there. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. I'll see you in the next one. Thank you so much. Later.